Hi friends, welcome back to YouTube channel name Steady Karnataka. Today in this video, we will be discussing top 5 important question that can be probably asked in the examinations. It may be state PCS or central level exams. It may be either SSC, RRB or any of the central level or any of the state level exam. So, the top 5 questions on the CRIPS missions are here. So, let's begin the quiz. As we all know, if you have studied the modern history, why was Cripps mission came to India? It came to India in order to seek the confidence as well as support of the Indian leaders to participate in the World War II and make the Britishers to win. This was the first motive and it came to India in the year 1942. So the question is asking in which year did the Cripps mission came to India? So it came to India in the year 1942. Next question. Who of the following Prime Minister sent Cripps mission to India? You need to remember this fact that the Prime Minister was Winston Churchill and the Cripps mission was headed by Sir Stafford Cripps. So the answer here will be Winston Churchill. The third question is who proposed the Cripps mission as I told in the previous slide itself that it was the Sir Stafford Cripps who headed this Cripps mission and he was the one who proposed this mission. So answer will be Sir Stafford Cripps. Next question the plan of Sir Stafford Cripps envisaged that after the second world war that means what did what was its main objective. Options are India should be partitioned into two before granting independence. Was this the right one? No, it was not. This was at the later stance. The second option is India should be granted complete independence. Not at all. Britishers was not willing to provide complete independence and lose India from their hands. So they were trying to give the dominant status to India. So the answer here will be India should be given the dominant status. That is option number C. The fifth and the last question of this video, who viewed the Cripps proposal as a post dated check upon a crashing bank? Do remember this is one of the most important question and favorite questions for all the exams whichever you write in maybe either state level or it may be at the central level. It was said by the Mahatma Gandhi that Cripps proposal was a post dated check upon a crashing bank. That means, as we all know that in 1930 itself in Lahore session it was discussed that we need complete Swaraj by Jawaharlal Nehru it was proclaimed. From that day onwards Indians were fighting for complete independence and the question of dominant status was completely gone. At this time when the Crips proposal came to India, they were saying that we will be providing the dominant status for you after the World War II. Instead of that, you should provide us the support for the war. So Gandhi said that you are providing a check which has already from the bank which has already been crashed. That means what was the bank before 1930 the nationalists were in the intention that Britishers should provide the dominion status. But after 1930 the scenario has completely changed and the nationalists or the freedom fighters were in the view that if they want the freedom that must be in the complete Swaraj that means a full independence. Therefore Gandhi said that this was the post dated check upon a crashing bank. So let's submit and wait for the result. So if you want such quizzes to be attended daily do subscribe to channel and share it with your friends. Do remember out of these questions at least one or two will be direct in your exams and it will be benefit for you. Hope you will get immense knowledge from this. This is just the crisp, crisp video that I will be making for you on the daily basis so that you can enjoy reading. So we can see that we have answered all the five questions completely right. For such videos Stay tuned on our channel. Thanks for watching the video. Thank you so much.